that if I ever get to meet the, the people that are behind the children that are teaching the children the dance moves and the uh, the archi- I would say the architectness to the music I have to find some music for myself okay when I I praise dance though I don't really you know you have to teach me to the dance moves to get it and if I ever get to meet those people again those children enlighten me enlighten my world okay made me feel like there's a place for you here in Baltimore Maryland so what I'm going to do is, is I'm going to soar a little bit it's just the place where I want to settle down and this is where I will be okay and because of the amount of money in which I have inherited to have from playing the Sweet States game, I will be able to have a home in um, Baltimore, Maryland, as well as Texas, okay? But the first thing is setting the plan. So basically, the head of state, the head of the state, the head of the state of um, D.C. and the head of the state of Maryland is sitting down on a video call. They're not in the same room. And then there's me, okay? And we're coming up with a plan. Well, so when I get my money, right, the plan is, you know you got to pay your bills. You know you got to have food. You know that you had to have clothes. You know that you need to um, pay these types of bills, okay? So, like, it's basically like um, I'm just the child that, that they have to help me with every single thing. Because basically, it's, it, it's like I went, it's like going back in time, okay? Like I went back in time, and now I'm back here, and now I'm like, ooh, wake up, wake up, wake up, you gotta wake up, okay? So, it's, so I'm, where I'm here, I gotta wake up. So, when the states say, see, she has woken up, she's not in a, in a, and from writing books for so long in the city of Richmond, um, the city of Richmond libraries, from writing books for so long, it takes you into a place, okay? And you have to come from out of that place and what you were in, okay? So I'm coming from out of that world in which I was in. So now it's like, okay, we got to do this. I got to pay bills. So I'm paying bills. When I get back to what a normal person really does, you feel me? Um, then um, I would get my money. Okay? These are steps that I got to take with the state. Got to pay my bills. Pay my bills now. Okay? So then the next step will be next thing that I got to do. And then these are the things which I have to do on every day, on a normal basis. And and it had been a sunk in my brain. These are the things I'm supposed to be doing. These are the things that I'm supposed to be doing. Um, um, the support packages. These are the things I'm supposed to be doing on a regular basis. You feel me? Um, when it comes to... Um, you got to eat every day. You got to take your medicine every day. These are the things in which the state is working with me with, and I appreciate each and every person, like seriously. I have gotten to the point where I am paying my bills like I'm supposed to pay my bills. I am happy about it. Um, because I'm in a haunted um, house, basically. This is what Chocolate um, Hill Apartments are. Um, I keep losing my wallet, but my wallet keep coming back to me, okay? So I keep losing stuff, stuff come back to me, okay? Good. I'm happy about it, feel me? But I want to be able to keep my cards that I have from the state, okay? And not lose them. Keep my driver's license. Ain't nobody going to steal it. I have my driver's license. Keep my cards, and I have my cards. You feel me? I have a special card, and it's called Instacart, okay? And I'm not using that right now. But I have it, Okay? It is like someone did this rich and got a black card. Okay? Okay? That's how I look at it. 
I'm not using it right now, but I have it. Okay, and I want them to know that I have your package. I'm just, we're not just using it right now. Right now, what I am doing is, I have to pay my bills once a month. Okay, we got to get that straight. I'm good with that. I'm okay with that. All right, so you, and so then we have to go into the next thing. Okay, so just, I'm learning. Bit, little bit by little bit. Every day is a challenge, though. It is. Because this is when I wake up in the morning, what can I remember? Okay. Um, what phone calls do I remember having? So instead of, I'm going to wait three or four days, I'm going to just go ahead and get on YouTube and say, and this person called me. And this is what I got from when, when this person called me. I did these things. What? How are you utilizing these things in your home? Because I could go, because I could lose my memory in a day. So I try to keep up with it, keep repeating myself, so that that it can stick. Okay. Regardless that I'm going to be purchasing a house, where then there are taxes to the house. And there are other things that you got to know about a house. And that's the stuff that I got to learn too. But it's just one step at a time right now. Right now, what we're doing is you have to pay your bills. Okay. Now, the situation here was, ain't nobody want to open up the door. The property manager said, they can't nobody come into the building. Now, people are going into the building. <laughs> I think maybe because the people are working on the building, the reason why people are coming into the building but I'm not sure, but I'm just giving $200 for my rent, regardless the rent is $147, okay, so, um, I have to get on YouTube, okay, and I have to say, and today, I got these series of calls, this is what I get from these series of calls, okay, so then next, but then now I'm starting to get calls um, that I feel like um, projects grant stock up. Where I can um, say like this and this go, this goes with this and this goes with this, this goes with this. Basically, I had to do with Mr. Um, Davidson. Um, this is how I'm thinking. First, because I haven't seen you so long been so many years you know so then what am I actually trying to get out so then I got it out and I text Mr. Luke and he has everything software product this is what I am creating okay so now I have the book and with the book Virginia will get to choose what books can I actually publish, okay? Because then uh, the the person who helped me with writing my books was God, okay? Right? In order for me to read the actual Bible, it's the words in which I would have to put on the page, okay? So there's some stuff you ain't going to, some stuff that I write, you ain't going into no church and you're not going to read this to anybody, Okay? It's an aftermath. It's like an aftermath writing when you write from, when you have God to teach you how to write a book. Okay? And I'm being rude to God, but I just would like to write a profound book. So I was trying to read the Bible, and I was having complications with reading the Bible. So, then I went into, oh, well then when you write this, this book right here, this book kind of different than this book, and this book is different than this book. Okay? So, it's a learning lesson, actually, when you're writing a book, okay? But, when you can't comprehend a book, and you're trying to read the book, okay? It's what I'm going to teach you, how to do that, okay? And you have to be mindful and respectful to God, okay? Because everybody pissed me off, made me mad, I put all my anger into the book. Then I have a special place where I put my books, okay? Where can't nobody... Mess with my books, okay? So then I go to the library and then see, and 
It will take you into a fantasy world when you do it. Then you got to come out your fantasy. You got to come out your fantasy now, okay?